So way to just skip a week. This is an explanation video for the sentence on the previous slide. Uh, that is the audeant ille vire et feminae esse fortes one. So first we need to determine uh, is there a subjunctive in this sentence? So I'm looking for subjunctive middle vowels. I'll find a subjunctive middle vowel here with the ea and audeant. That should tell me a few things. That should tell me that it is subjunctive and it's second conjugation. So hopefully you recognize that and got that this is from audeo with an eo instead of audio with an io. Audeo meaning to dare. So first that is our verb. Now I'm looking for type of subjunctive. Uh, now I notice there's only one verb in the sentence, one main verb. We do have essay down here as an infinitive but only one main verb in our sentence, and there is no ut or ne. That tells me that this is a jussive subjunctive. Now on to the rest of our sentence. Looking for a subject, I do have weary and femini that are both nominative. So I'm going to go with those two as our combined subject. Then we're left just with fortes since illy goes with weary there, left just with fortes, which is an adjective, and it can only match with weary and femini. And a nice predicate adjective after our linking verb there, sum as a complementary infinitive. So, time to translate, oh, time to parse. I didn't parse our verb for us yet. Audeant, that NT tells us third person plural, that is present, because that's the only one we know so far. Present, active, subjunctive of audeo, audere. Now time to translate, starting with our subject. We start with illy, weary, those men, and femini, and women. But we need to get our jussive translation in there. So let those men and women dare for audeant, essay to be Fortes brave. Let those men and women dare to be brave. This is a complementary infinitive, so we translate it like a normal infinitive rather than trying to put it into like our indirect statement kind of translation. So again, let those men and women dare to be brave. Predicate adjective there in fortes. 